What's up, how's it going? I'm Enrique and this is Easy Pictures to Draw. Today we're going to go over how to draw a cute pirate. Uh, <clears throat> we're going to be using this marker and we're using some colored pencils as well. I'll bring in the, I'll, I'll tell you the colors as I bring in the colors. Um, but yeah, pirate, cute pirates and it'll hopefully be easy and it'll be easy for you to follow along. So follow along if you like, I actually suggest it. And um, so let's, get, oh okay, one last thing. If you guys like drawing tutorials about cute caricatures, if you guys like drawing cute characters, if you guys like drawing, um, you know, anything, any basic drawing, um, tips on just how to draw in general, please hit that subscribe button and you're going to get notifications for that. So let's kind of get started. Oh yeah, also you got to hit that subscribe button and also click the bell icon to get notifications on that. So let's start. I'm gonna start this in the way I start many of these, which is kind of this lower, under, it's like, imagine like a U, but you're just doing the sides of the U. And actually for this one, we're gonna connect it in any, in any way you want. I'm gonna draw a slanted line underneath. Slanted line's gonna be his bandana. And then I'm gonna draw a straight line Connect that down. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw his hat. Pirate hat. It's got long edges here. It's going to have a big hump toward the middle. Hopefully that fits in the page. On this side, I'm going to draw the eye patch and I'm gonna fill that in with the marker it is imagine a sunglasses lens you know and then draw him kind of that smileyness <clears throat> drawing his mouth open it's gonna be a straight line with kind of a almost like a curved V underneath And then his tongue's gonna be in there. So he's gonna be happy and joyous. His hair. And then this bandana is gonna have a circle of its own because it's gonna have the tie. And what I'm going to do is going to do the edge of the kind of coats that he has in real simplistic form shapes. Straight line downward, a flat outward, and kind of a straight line in. And I'm going to draw boxes at the end of his hands. Those are going to be kind of the sleeves. Hook for a hand on that side. His legs. And in there I'm going to draw his pants, his belt. Peg leg. And this is going to be his normal leg. Remember, think of these as very simple, simple shapes. I know it's starting to get complex, but it's really simple. Just think of circle, square. I'm just, this is just a square, half circle. That's all this is. Half circle for the sword. <clears throat> I'm 
going to his hat, circle, straight line downward, kind of a box shape for the skull. And I'm going to do the little crossbones on the side. It's going to be circle, circle, straight line, straight line. A lot of these are very simple, simple, like I said, super simple shapes. So let's go into the coloring. I'm going to go take the red here, the red, and this is a Crayola brand colored pencil. I'm going to go into the bandana that's underneath his hat here. Over here on the edge as well. All right, <clears throat> let's continue. Now we're going to do, we're going to grab the peach. Oh, I'm sorry. Red, actually, we're going to continue with the, the, the tongue here. And then we're going to have peach. Peach colors for skin tone, normally, uh, depending. And I'm going to not grind it in too much, but I really want to make it uh, evident. I'm just gonna kind of push it in. I'm gonna try not to go over the, the black marker with it either. It might give it a different uh, value. Then I'm going to go in and <clears throat> color his hat. So you can do a couple of things with a hat. Uh, I would say like, well, hold on. First thing is I'm going to get a brown color, that little bit of hair sticking out. I'm gonna actually, I could use a black for the hat, like a typical pirate. I'd like to use blue, honestly. Um, maybe like dark blue, just to kind of change it a little bit. And you can choose whatever color you want, but I'm gonna use blue in the, like I said, that Crayola marker. Almost like this navy blue. These don't actually say the names of the colors on them, by the way. Well, at least this Crayola brand that I'm using. And the, the, the hat's a big, uh, it's like a big, it's like a big space to fill in. So just be, be aware of that as well. You're, you're, it's almost like you're coloring your own coloring book when you do this stuff. Except you're doing the lines for it. And because it's such a small colored pencil, I mean, I guess it's a small space uh, that you're using, like a small tip, it's gonna take a little bit. Again, just kind of grinding it in there. But, uh, I remember, I'll tell you a funny story. Um, when I was in, um, when I was working at SeaWorld, I was actually a, uh, caricature artist there, and some little boy, he wanted to be drawn as Jack Sparrow. I would caricature his face, and then he wanted, like, I guess, like a, like an awesome, kind of, uh, edgy, like, Jack Sparrow kind of drawing underneath it, 
under you know like as, as a body and I, what I ended up doing was drawing a very very typical pirate like this <laughs> very very typical pirate and he was uh, very uh, I could tell he was very annoyed <laughs> I just didn't have Jack Sparrow in my mind at that moment in terms of like what his design of his outfit was it might be another video here I'd have to I would have to actually look at it sometimes people grab their phones and you can look at it but you know that changes quite a bit and I'm gonna go over here to the coat and also give it a blue tint uh, if you want you can actually um, make him like not wear a shirt underneath there give him like Take that peach and color his chest with it there. I really need a sharpener soon. It's just my sharpener is broken uh, or lost. I can't really find my sharpener, so we're just gonna deal with this. Oof. And let's check out the color of uh, his sword. I'm going to grab an orange right here for the handle of the sword. I'm going to have a gray. A gray that's totally broken. Here's another gray. A gray for the sword itself. I'm just going to go up and leave patches in it on purpose. Kind of those highlights. And, oops, we need the brown for his peg leg. And his pants, uh, I'm going to probably make his pants orange as well. Maybe his little sleeves will be orange, like light orange, you know, color them less. And that's pretty much it, guys. I uh, appreciate you watching. Uh, please let me know. Uh, if you guys liked it, please, please press that thumbs up. And we can chat. I'll put like a little green here on his belt. It's like aqua. <laughs> Thanks a lot for watching, guys. I appreciate it. If you guys like uh, drawing cute stuff, caricatures, if you guys like drawing cartoon characters, or if you want like how-to videos in terms of like, uh, if you guys like would like tips on drawing your favorite characters, please. Uh, press like and uh oh please subscribe and press that little bell icon and i will get back to you guys thank you so much whatever you guys write on the comments here i will reply please and uh, i'll talk to you later